wish you could see yourself Just sitting there on my chair I'm staring at you You don't even notice Should have told you straight away You don't have to be afraid YouTubers, what's going on? The grass is all cut, and I just come out to enjoy it. And I'm not the only one that enjoys it. There's Blue jays and robins, sparrows, hummingbirds, cardinals and redbirds. Everybody's enjoying the freshly cut grass. Even I saw a couple of squirrels. It's a squirrel feeder. I am smoking my Peterson Spagat 303 and in it, Cal Nice Burns. In it, I'm smoking Colt Blood Red Moon chocolate and cherry. And the best way to describe it is those cherry cordials that you get around Christmas. It's like taking one of those and every time you take a puff, you're eating a cherry cordial, which I love, by the way. It's 84 degrees. But the wind is slightly blowing, so it keeps you kind of cool. Just love coming out here. It's feeling the wind hit you and just just relax. It's chilling. Everybody has their own stuff that keeps them moving and busy and around them from here to there. I gotta do this, I gotta do that. Are you always in a hurry? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on now, we gotta go, we gotta go. And it's just nice to sometimes just sit down. Watch life. Take in nature, take in life. Sit and watch a stream. Just watch the water flow. 
just find something. You just just see it. Don't have to talk to nobody. Don't have to watch TV. You don't have to do nothing. Just see it. I had a guy message me this morning. Wanting a couple of tampers. Honey tampers. Uh, so I said, I said, what's your address? You know, and he gave me his address. He said, uh, just let me know how much. As I tell all of you all, because he said he hasn't watched any of my videos, so as I tell all of you all, you all already know what I told him. I don't want nothing. I don't want nothing. You don't have to, you don't have to send me money. You don't have to send me anything of monetary value. You don't have to send me back no tobacco. You don't have to send me back nothing. You don't have to do a VR. You don't have to do a Yabo. You don't have to do nothing. Nothing. I don't want nothing. I do things, as you all already know, without wanting anything back in return. He was like, that's ridiculous. I was like, well, I'm a ridiculous man, I guess, because I don't want nothing. He's a nice guy. He just wants to, you know, he wants to pay for stuff like some of y'all do. But I promise you, I promise you, I promise you, I know some of y'all don't understand. I know because I didn't understand either. But I promise you, you'll get to a point in your life. You'll get to a point in your life one of these days. And it might be on your deathbed. I don't know. But there's no amount of money, there's no item, there's nothing you can do that's going to change what the fact of what your, your situation that you're in. And the only thing that's going to matter is maybe it's a nurse, maybe all your family's passed away, maybe you don't have a family, maybe, you know, or maybe you do. But maybe it's a nurse, maybe it's your sister, your brother, maybe it's your mom, your dad. Maybe it's one of your kids, your son, your daughter, aunt and uncle, nurse, doctor. But you're going to be in a situation. And that person is just going to look at you and smile and talk to you. And you're going to just sit there. And you're going to you're going to appreciate that smile. You're going to appreciate that. That little chat. And that's where I'm at now. I just want to sit here I want to watch the birds. When I go in, I want to watch y'all's videos. I just want to smile. I want to see other people smile. I want to try to make other people smile.
Well, I got this smoked out. I smoked it long before. You can see it's well, it's well. Now I've tamped it. It's well beyond. Anyway, I have some footage for y'all. I took of the birds as I come out. I have some birds. Just some was walking. Some was here at the bird feeders. And some out there at the squirrel feeders. One was out here on my porch. And I, I took uh, my banana trees that started to grow. So I'm happy about that. And I got a banana tree. Banana tree in eastern Kentucky? A banana tree? Yeah. Snowder lady gave it to me. She had them. Uh, some of hers don't produce bananas, and some do, but she gave me one little one, and I transplanted it. And every year, there's you'll see in the video, there's probably like, I had to cut like 10 last year and left like four. And you can see the four kind of, they're kind of dead, but you can see like eight popping up already, and I'll have to cut those. And then there'll still be plenty come up this year. And they grow up big and tall. I can't wait for you all to see how big they are and the big old leaves that come out. They're so pretty. Listen that the wind chimes. I'm having a pretty good day, and I hope you are. I hope you're having a wonderful weekend. As always, I hope you're smoking the blends that you love and the pops that you love. You have a good day. See you.